a show of military force in Iran during its annual Army Day celebrations. The goal? To show the nation's military preparedness. But the event this year comes just days after Iran launched an unprecedented attack on Israel, for whose leaders the president had this warning. If our action was to be large-scale, then nothing would be left of the Zionist regime. Their false grandeur collapsed in operation. Any attack on our soil will be dealt with fiercely and severely. Iran launched more than 300 drones and missiles towards Israel on Saturday. In response to the attack on its consulate section in Damascus on April 1st, which killed seven members of the Revolutionary Guards. The operation, dubbed True Promise by the military, is being viewed here as a historic win. But concerns about what comes next has put the country on high alert. If Israel targets a site in Iran that is not that sensitive, for example, somewhere close to the border, since Iran is not looking for war, then in this case Iran could respond through its proxies. But if Israel attacks any sensitive sites, I think Iran will respond on a larger scale and even its allies like U.S. interests could be targeted in the region. As Iranian officials wait for Israel to respond, they continue to highlight their military strengths. The attack on Israel has shown that Iran's leaders are willing to follow through on their threats. While daily life goes on without any major disruption, the historic tensions have put people on edge fearing that an attack here could have far-reaching consequences. Dorsa Jabari, Al Jazeera, Tehran. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.